the rules of engagement are are orders and they're they're subsidiary to the defense act um so they are law and the rule of engagement that we use is the base defense force rules of engagement in peacetime regulations 2002 si 75. these these rules govern or or govern all the situations or more situations where a soldier might find himself in in dealing with the, the general public or any other group of people so the 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 rules of engagement covers any other, any situation where a soldier may be required to use force and the levels of force that are appropriate for 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 whatever situation he might find himself in in an incident such as what transpired in santa familia what is the course of action to be taken by the police defense force in determining culpability on the part of the officer who fired the shot? Well, I can't talk about specific that specific incident itself, but I can just reference the rules of engagement. And in the rules of engagement, it uh, mentions that when encountering aggressive or pro provocative civilians, a warning must be given about the possible um, results of his actions. Um, and there, there should be an attempt, or if time and space permit, there should be an attempt to disarm or disable any aggressive or provocative civilians. And the most importantly, the use of force must be proportional to the threat. Okay, unless there's an imminent um, threat of loss of life. Since it, since the incident that you're referring to resulted in loss of life. The, the police will be have the primary jurisdiction here where their investigation will cover the circumstances surrounding the incident and whether any criminal charges should be levied against anyone.